Wait, where are we going? Living life every day, let it die, not okay. All I want and I pray, all I need are some better days. So we are at the bookstore that Harry Potter was inspired by. It's cool. There was a long line to get in and I just paid 10 extra dollars and we didn't have to wait in the line. I'm smart. This girl has asked Abby to take their picture, but they don't want anyone on the stairs. So they, they're blocking. There they go. <laughs> there are so many people here. Like, this is so crap. What a relaxing environment to read a book. Oh my god. Look at how many, it's just a funnel, it's like an attraction at a Disneyland. I feel like I'm walking through a line at Disneyland to get to a ride. So we did the, oh yeah, I said vodka soda and they gave Sprite. Um, so we did the bookstore. It's a, it was very crowded. It was pretty. I also don't quite know what part of Harry Potter was, ins was inspired by it. The staircase inspired some of the Harry Potter stuff. I don't, I don't know. But we're on the rooftop that we were at like last week. The ladies are having a drink. It's a chill day. So we went to the house and I edited and then people were DMing us on Instagram that there's a pride parade happening and it's supposed to start happening at 3 and it's 3.38 so we're a little late but we were doing things. So uh, I see gays. Let's see what we can find. So we're at the pride thing but we don't really know like what's going on. Like if there's a parade or if there's something supposed to be happening or everyone's just hanging out at a park, we don't quite know. So it's we're supposed to start at three and it's 3.55. I'm kind of hungry, we might go get sardines. <laughs> we left the gathering because we didn't know what was going on, but we're at a place to get sardines. But look it, it's like we're still at Pride. Ally! Sardines with it. potatoes. So we don't think it tastes bad. It's just, there's a lot of little bones. So it's like a lot of work to eat. But we don't think they're bad. Apparently the sardine dish is very famous here. Not this restaurant in Porto. What? We might be doing it wrong. I thought I developed it pretty well. But there were just so many bones in it. I don't know if you're supposed to eat them, but they, they get caught in my throat. bopping around and now we're getting dinner before we do a bridge climb tonight which should be a lot of fun and I'm guessing pretty cold but I brought a Patagonia. So we're about to climb this? Let's go. going. 
climbing a bridge. Basically, it's just a lot of stairs. Hello. Hello. Seriously, what is with Europe and stairs? Head back and the mop. Don't worry, Mom. We were strapped in the whole time. We survived the bridge climb. Um, it was actually a lot of fun. We, the tour guide human being was really, really nice. We ended up just, we, she took us up there. It takes five minutes to get up there. And then we sat for an hour and just chatted with her. And she was really awesome. The first thing she asked us was like, you're American? We're like, yeah, from California. She's like, what is happening with your abortion laws? <laughs> and we were like, right? It's terrible. She's like, what in the world? She was all mad for us. So just, you know, the people in Europe uh, hate it too. But uh, anyway. She was amazing. We had a lot of fun up there. It was actually scarier coming down because I don't know, it hurt my knees. But we're back. We survived. And uh, Zara, Abby, and I are going to go grab a drink um, at a bar down the street. Just because Zara only has two more nights here. And tomorrow night she has to go to bed early because she has an early flight. So we're going to go get a singular drink down the road. That is it for this vlog. That's it. That's the end of this. We had a lot of fun at the bridge climb. Oh, we found a bar that's called the Big Bad Bank Bar. It is a mouthful, uh, but we had fun. We found a kind of nice little drink there. They had a room. I don't know why I didn't take a picture of it. I get to a certain point of the day where I'm like, it's enough of the vlog camera. It's enough. But there's like a room with fake American money draped over a bed. And the reason I didn't go in it, it seemed very germy. Like, that's just a lot of germs. COVID's made me realize there's germs everywhere. Before, I didn't care. I'd like a sidewalk. Now I'm like, gross. Human. I mean, humans are just gross. That's just true. But COVID's made me view things differently, which I am appreciative of. I guess there's a silver lining if you really want to find it. Um, anyway, we had a drink there and it was a lot of fun. But the bridge climb, I also wanted to mention. So during the bridge climb, we told her, uh, her name was Rita, babe. Rita, fantastic human being. We loved her. We actually sat on the bridge, on the top of the bridge for about an hour. And she told us like stories of the bridge. And like people used to go up there and like climb it without support and didn't always end well. But she also talked to us. Hi, I see it. Yes, this is a ball. Go play. We had mentioned to her that we did the bookstore in the morning. And she was like, yeah, people in Portugal, like JK Rowling lived here for like two years. And so people of Portugal really try to relate her to like to her stay in Portugal to all her harry potter books and stuff but she's like we're just speculating it's not true like we don't act really <laughs> she wants me to play with her ball she's like we don't actually know if any of the book was inspired by or the movie or like you know how it's filmed was inspired by anything in portugal we all just like us like to assume it because you know we want to feel special but she, apparently jk rowling tweeted a while ago which i don't like to look at any jk rowling's tweets because she's very anti lgbtq plus community which is weird especially towards the trans community. But apparently she tweeted that the bookstore had absolutely nothing to do with the design of the book, whatever. I don't know. So you hear things, myths happen. That's just another one. Who knows? I don't know if she's just like not wanting to relate. I don't, I don't know. It's not my life. Uh, we went to a bookstore. It was pretty. And there's a dog. Again, just, do you need attention? All right, I'm going to go play with the dog. I love you guys. And I'll see you next vlog. Bye. Bye.